Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I am Stephanie. Thank you for tuning in to yet another video. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that notification bell. And let's get right into the video. So today guys, our perfume for today, we're going to talk about Oscar de la Renta. And this is Miss Bella Rosa. She is gorgeous, girl. Look at that. <laughs> I'm being extra. Um, this is like a baby pink. And she has these little beautiful roses, like a 3D look. And this is a gold plate. This is a gold lid. And this has a pink, a pink color right here. And then the back is just flat. There's nothing you know extravagant about the back yeah 3.4 fluid ounce so this fragrance is a so this is a floral fragrance okay so this has top notes of pink pepper frieza and mandarin orange our middle notes is pink rose jasmine and oris and then our base notes is patchouli sandalwood and amber and i failed to mention that this was also launched in 2019. so overall this is a sweet floral rose fragrance when I tell you that this is extravagant hold on my hair <laughs> when I tell you that this is extravagant it's smooth it's creamy it's rich it's everything that you would want in a rose perfume the only downside is that this is more of a perfume rose. This is not a synthetic rose. This is more of a perfume rose. And you get that overall it's like a sweet amber perfumey rose uh, patchouli fragrance that's like dazzling in a floral garden. It's just perfect when I tell you that that patchouli and that sandalwood is just so well rounded and mixed in this fragrance I am not kidding you it's beautiful and I believe I only spent around 40 maybe 30 dollars for her and this is a 3.4 fluid ounce and I was just amazed yeah, so the like the rose is it's more of like a perfume rose. It's like it's not artificial, but then it's not like a literal rose. It's a perfume rose, if that makes sense. Because you know, a fragrance can either be synthetic or it can be, you know, authentic, you know, the notes. So like sometimes rose fragrances, rose perfumes, they kind of smell synthetic and some of them they smell like a literal rose. This one does not smell like a literal rose, but the rose is beautiful. I feel like people who don't like synthetic notes and that kind of bothers you, I feel like Bella Rose would definitely work out for you because it's not synthetic it's not artificial it's not cheap smelling it's not something that you're like yeah that's a $12 perfume like this actually smells like it could be a hundred dollars um the quality and the performance on this is a 10 out of 10 the longevity the silage the scent itself 10 out of 10 I believe on my skin this lasted six plus hours so it's well longer than just like four hours it's six plus hours guys so if you like rose fragrances sweet rose fragrances then I would definitely try this out if you don't already have it in your collection um, I bought mine at fragrancenet.com and I'm really pleased it's, it's 
for me, it's, it has an extravagant, rich, um, expensive vibe to it. And it's beautiful. I can't stress that enough. It's beautiful, guys. <laughs> it's so just beautiful. And I feel like I always will have this in my collection because I'm, I'm, I'm pretty pleased with the performance and the scent. It, it blew me away. It really did uh, blow me away. Um, I will be uh, purchasing the a decant, or not a decant, but like a, a small um, sample of Delina so I can kind of compare and contrast because I don't know if you know this, but this is supposed to be a dupe for Delina so I don't know that yet so once I get that sample I'll be able to compare and contrast and actually give you my full um, detailed review uh, so yeah thank you for tuning in to yet another video um, don't forget to hit that subscribe button don't forget to hit that notification bell and I love you guys and as always have a blessed week and weekend and I will see you in my next video.